St. Joe Live Movie Reviews. The Magnificent Seven is a remake of a classic remake of a classic film. You tell Bo, if he wants his town, come see me. Based on Seven Samurai by Akira Kurosawa and the 1960s all-star western, this movie tries to do the same thing, but I have a feeling it won't be regarded as a classic, just a fun western. Directed by Antoine Fuqua and reuniting his training day co-stars Denzel Washington and Ethan Hawke, the movie centers around a group of outlaws who are paid to take back the small town of Rose Creek from the hands of the evil Bartholomew Bogue. Assembling a ragtag team, which includes Chris Pratt and Vincent D'Onofrio, the bounty hunter Sam Chisholm, played by Denzel Washington, must take down the bad guys and save the citizens of the town. And that's really all there is to it. The best way to describe this movie is a western created by a person who has been described what old, old westerns were like, but hasn't ever seen them. It's mainly just the good guys killing a bunch of villains in every way imaginable for a PG-13 movie. The characters and their motivations aren't really fleshed out, so it skates by on the likability of its cast to get the job done and they do a good job. They're fun and have charming chemistry. The big knock that I can give against it is that the more interesting, diverse characters are sent to the background to make room for more wisecracks from Chris Pratt. The Magnificent Seven is a fun time with some thrills and fantastic set pieces. I give it three and a half Joes out of five. It's a good time if you're looking for a solid Western. To read my review, check out Sancho Live in Friday's edition of the St. Joseph News Press and go online to sancholive.com. And join me next week as I team up with Bob Schultz and we review Tim Burton's latest film, Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children. Until then, we'll be live at the movies. See you later.